Hello everyone, this is Mumbo here, welcome back, and today we're going to be taking a look at something really awesome, and that is the 2x2 seamless glass hipster door. Now it came to my attention the other day that recently, I've been uploading a lot of the simple survival friendly stuff, which although it is cool, you guys seem to really love them, it does mean that a lot of my videos have been the same old, same old, so I thought I'd switch things up a bit and build something insane, and this is what I've come up with. So in front of us we have got ourselves a completely flat glass wall, no visible pistons or redstone, and on the other side there is a chest, and I'm sure you can all assume what is in that chest. I sort of want them, so we just flick this lever here, and you'll see that the middle section of our wall begins to drop down. Now it does take a little while, and that's just because a lot of things are happening at once, but there we have it, it's all done. Still no visible pistons or redstone, which is great to see, so then you can head on inside, pick up your bosun hose, and have a fantastic time. Then once you're done, just head back on out, flick your lever again, and you'll see the middle section of the wall just pops back up as good as new. Now I'm sure there's some of you watching right now who are wondering why this is so difficult. I mean surely it's not that hard to open up a glass door. Well I can tell you now, there's a lot more to it than you may think. There's triple piston extenders, double piston extenders, tons of block storage, there's just things going everywhere and it's a bit of a mess down there. And that brings me on to my next point, which is the redstone behind it. So I'm going to jam on my camera studio mod and let's take a look. And here it is, this is the 2x2 seamless glass hipster door, and I think the first thing that's on most of your mind is, that's pretty huge. I know, I know, there's a lot of redstone behind it, and I'm secretly proud of this one, because it's been a while since I did a project like this, and I'm very happy with how dense the wiring is. I mean, there's no getting in there. Debugging this thing was an absolute nightmare, because I couldn't see half of the redstone behind it. Having said that, the footprint, the actual size of the build, is pretty huge. I'm fairly rusty on this kind of thing. I haven't done a project like this for many months, and that is why I feel like the community could probably do a better job at compacting this down than I do. So I would like to issue a challenge. I want you to see if you can make a smaller version of this build, and if you can, could you please submit a video response down below? I will check out all of the video responses, and if I think it is good enough, then you may get it uploaded onto my channel. So, there we go, that's a bit of an incentive for you. But if you can't wait that long, then of course I will put the world download and the MC Edit schematic in the description below so you can check that out for yourselves. And perhaps if you're absolutely mental, like I'm talking insane, you could try and build it for yourself. But unfortunately that is all I've got time for for today, so if you enjoyed this video, please remember to hit that like button. And if you really loved it, then make sure to subscribe. But thanks for watching guys, this has been Mumbo, and I'm out. I'll see you later.